when I get, uh, uh, it was, I mean, it was 10 years ago when I started working as a human rights activist. Uh, there was a newspaper that I used to read uh, and admire. Uh, I used to admire the journalists who works at, the, at that newspaper. Uh, and the government uh, uh, start intimidating these journalists and they were, they were forced to flee the country because of intimidations. Uh, so, I mean, and I have left with, uh, I mean, even the country have left, has left with, with no uh, independent medias. The, the, there, there was only government uh, controlled medias that echoed, echoed uh the achievement of the government only the achievement of the government so i start expressing myself on facebook then i met new people then that that turned me to uh, uh human rights i mean activists like because many politicians uh were in prison uh, charged like life sentence 80 years uh uh, with the terrorism law, so I, I and my friend used to go to prison and visit them. Uh, one of, I mean, then even the name Zonain uh, comes with uh, the the prison actually. So uh, when we when we go to prison to visit these journalists and politicians. The country uh, federal prison, which is Galiti Federal Prison, has eight different zones. Uh, and the prisoners who inside the Galiti Federal Prison uh, say that they, 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 that they refer the outside as zone nine, uh, referring that that we, I mean, we don't have any freedom because there was no media. Uh, the, the, there was no any independent organization. And even the prisoners consider uh, the whole country country as uh, zone nine because they have eight different zones in Galiti Federal Prison, which the prison uh, admin used to separate prison from prison. And those prisoners call the outside world as zone nine. Uh, so, and that that's uh, that's where we got our name, by the way. So, and since since then, I mean, we start blogging and campaigning uh, on on online. I mean, using social media. Even even our blog was blogged. Uh, like eight times uh, after we opened it. I mean, we have to, we recreate uh, and recreate a new blog, a new blog. And even within a week, within three days, within four days, I mean, they keep blocking it. So, I mean, even, even at small level, at small, when we were at, at small level, the repression, was high. So then, I mean, who else would you, who else, that, who else that who would fight our fight like? Uh, we decided that uh, that there is no going back and we start uh, echoing our voices against the repression uh, uh, against the anti-democracy uh, regime. And uh, I think finally we kind of succeed. I think I mean, I'm proud of that moment, actually. 10 years back, I was young. I was uh, kind of revolutionary. <laughs> uh, uh, but now, uh, 
because I, I was I am a victim of human rights violation. I mean, it is it is a very important uh, uh, rights that that should that people should get. I mean, yeah. uh, I have spent eighteen months in prison. Uh, uh, the first three three months, I was in in Makalai uh, investigation centers. I mean, I have to. I, I, I was tortured there. I was in the dark cell for three months, uh, forced to see, see the sunlight for ten minutes a day. Uh, I mean, forced to use the toilet while twice a day. The door was. 24/7 locked, uh, and uh, there was beatings uh, and so many other things, and uh, there was a psychological torture. So, uh, I mean, uh, right now, I mean that that should that that shouldn't uh, happen to. Anyone, though, so I should. I have to fight for the respect of uh, my, my people, like the, the respect of the rights of my people. So, I mean, I'm, I have. I think I have uh, a good reason. <laughs> uh, well, my hope is. Uh, I mean, I don't want anyone. Uh, uh, to be, I mean, tortured. Uh, I mean, I want justice. Uh, I mean, for any, any, any individuals, like even if a criminal uh, or he or she is a criminal, uh, justice has to be served in the right way. The country has a law which everyone respects, and uh, even uh, I mean the the government should uh, respect it as well. Uh, I mean my vision is I I want my country to be very democrat, like uh, as I said before. Uh, uh, the the organization that I and my friends are leading right now are working on the advancement of rights and democracy. I want my country to be an example of any rights and democracy.